Irish. I am Leo Mora and uh, I'm here with the group at the O'Hare Stone. We're here for the April the 18th spectacular, which happens every year, but without fail. Today we didn't get to see the sun because uh, it was a break in the clouds. But the O'Hare Stone here is a big rock, slab of rock, which is inscribed with rock art. And there's lots of different concentric circles here. And uh, it is the most decorated rock art stone in Ireland, it's dating from the Bronze Age period, which will be looking back around 1500 years or so before the time of Christ. But long before the birth of Christ, there would have been people who passed along this route going to the mountain of Propatrick, or became known as Propatrick. And that would have been because it was a, a pagan site and uh, venerated for lots of people throughout the country for whatever powers or significance it had to people at that, at that time. Do the rings mean anything? Uh, nobody knows exactly why they have been inside. Like some people maintain that you do get them in areas where there is a presence of gold, and we know now like there is gold on Crow Patrick, okay. And you get that in parts of Scotland as well, also down the Kerry. And other people maintain it was inscribed because of the phenomenon that we just saw, like you know, that it was marking two outstanding dates in the year. The date for the commencement of harvesting and planting, mm. respectively, at different times in the year. But uh, definitively, nobody can be certainly sure, you know. And uh, until Jerry Bracken did his testing here and came up with the dates of April and August, we weren't even aware of that importance to us. So, is it part of the Cropatrick Walk now? Or? Uh, it is. It is no, on, yeah, it is on the, the route now, like you know, the, the, the Cropatrick Trail. Yeah. 